Toby Edser, Ebsleet United, you came on, you made your debut. Within five minutes, you got on the score sheet. That must be the perfect introduction to life at Fleet. Yeah, I couldn't have, couldn't have asked for much more, to be fair. I, I was having a conversation with a couple of the boys on the bench and we did uh, discuss it and I did say I'd love to come on and score just to settle the ship and get my like season up and running. So, yeah, I was really, re really delighted. So what were you thinking when you got the call? You know, the, the manager turned around and said, on you. What, what were you thinking then? What, what, what were you hoping to achieve when you got out there? Well, first of all, I was just excited. It's like pure excitement to come on because I was injured at the back end of last season. So it felt like I hadn't been involved in a match day for so long. Um, so yeah, excitement and just relaxed really. Um, I knew what I had to come on and do. Um, knew my roles, knew my responsibilities. And I just went, tried to go out there and enjoy it and I did. And, and when you got into that position and the ball came to you, did, did the goal kind of open up and look bigger and bigger and bigger or did it look smaller and smaller and smaller? I can't really remember it to be fair. I, I just remember sort of following in someone's shot. I think it was Dom. Um, and yeah, I just try, I think I just tried to guide it back towards goal. I'll have to watch it again. It was a bit of a blur, but certainly enjoyed it. And you came here as a trialist and you were the last player to be signed. It's almost like you're the last piece of the jigsaw for Dennis Kutry. Do you feel that, that you're just the final piece of a, a project that's that's developing? It's one way to look at it. I was, when I first come in here, I, was, I just wanted to sort of show him what I could do. Um, and to be fair to him, he was very honest with me when from the first day he said they weren't actually looking for a midfielder um, that he wanted a striker um, and I really respected him for being honest you don't get that a lot in football um, so my respect for him straight away was there um, and I just it would have been easy for me to sort of go away and think oh there's, there's no point in trying but I wanted to make a make an impact and sort of make him sign me if you like um, and luckily I did. So you got your chance during pre-season and uh, you got a goal or two in pre-season, I believe. And uh, today, coming onto the pitch and scoring, I mean, that must have made you think, yes, the plan worked. Yeah, definitely. Um, more relief as well. Um, and a lot of footballers will say there's no better feeling than scoring goals. And uh, that's definitely something I want to add more to my game, um, goals. I tend to get quite a few assists, but putting the ball in the back and that's definitely up, like, up there for me that I want to improve. And, and if you're a goal-scoring midfielder, it's like Dennis has signed two players in one. So yeah, I suppose, yeah. <laughs> well, if I can give him that, I'm sure he'll be over the moon. And you seem to be one of several players in the side that are, are, are very good link players, you know, between the defence and, and attack. Your, your, your midfield role is very much, uh, uh, you know, bringing that all together so the ball is turning over all the time. And, and, and there's, there's a lot of talent out there, isn't there? Yeah, the, the talent in the squad is very good. Um, I was speaking to the manager the other day. I think if this team could compete in the league above, um, right up there, competing for the playoffs. So um, there's no excuses this year. Like I said, the, the, the talent's there. Um, you've just got to put it into practice and, and try and grind some results out. So what is the, a win on the first day of the season? A 3-0 win, OK, it was against 10 men in the end, but you can only beat what's in front of you. What, what does that do to the confidence and, and the conviction that you, you're on the right track? The confidence is, is always there anyway. Um, we, we believe that. We believe we've got the, the ability in the squad. Um, but yeah, it is nice to win on the opening day, obviously, um, and, and steady the ship, if you like. Um, but now we, we can just look to next week and uh, try and repeat it. Feeling at home, feeling comfortable? Definitely. And the fans took to you? I think so. I hope so. Well, I think after scoring, they're going to, aren't they? Oh, well, let's see. I need to think I need to do it a few more times. Well, do it again at Weymouth and do it again at Eastbourne. <laughs> and by the time you come back for the Farnbury game, they'll be very happy, won't I'll they? I'll try, yeah. Well, good luck with your career at Ebsley, and it's a fantastic start. Well done. Thank you. Congratulations. Cheers.